Nigga, fuck the tribe. Monkey D. Goofy. 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 What's good, people? It's your boy, T-Rap. I am here for another video. Right now, we have the Lady of Heaven trailer reaction. Now, this one was recommended to me by the, by the man of goodwill, and we appreciate you, good man. So, I don't know what this is about, but I'm ready for it. So, we can just pretty much go ahead and dive right in. I'm not going to lie, this looks... We could be in for some heat. I'm counting on you. I'm counting on you. We ready? We ready? All right, I think we're ready. So let's go. The world is in shock as a group of terrorists has taken control of large areas of Syria and Iraq. The world can be a cruel and dangerous place. Remember. It's crazy. Even if you're afraid, be strong. Your loving mother, Fatima. Damn. Did your mother ever tell you the story of the Lady of Heaven? She was very special. Daughter to the Prophet Muhammad. My time 40. is near. And afterwards, my lovely Fatima, you will face many trials. With my father no longer here to lead us, evil is with those who will extinguish the light of truth. You're gonna let a woman tell us what to do. We will burn her out. Yeah, it gets real like that, dog. Yes. We'll judge all of you. God. The big man. This world has become a breeding ground of violence. That's bad. The shadow will be cast across many generations to come. We're talking heavy. It said some people are so full of faith. Take his strength to everyone around him. Oh. The greatest thing in this life and the hereafter oh. is the spreading of peace in the world. Lady Fatima's goodness inspired people to stand up no matter what the cost. Her legacy lives on. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That's definitely yeah, something that's right. right up my alley. Um, but you know, anytime we go biblical, son, like that's some crazy stuff. But no, seriously, like I don't know the story of Lady Fatima. If this is a real legend or, or person of myth or of history in their culture, um, but I'm definitely interested to see to see where they take it because it seems like she's being brought back over and over again, and a similar result is happening. But obviously, a miracle's coming of it. So, yeah. All right, props. Props to the man of goodwill. You, you put something else on my radar. Um, Yeah, I mean, now I have the AMC Stubbs thing. So, I'm definitely willing to go catch that in the movie theater. Because, uh, hey, son, we had the, the big man. And then we had the angels from on high. And she, it seems like she was a prophet. Also, we're going back 1,400 years ago. So, yeah, you know, I'm all into all that stuff. And and just to, I always like when movies keep it real, you know what I'm saying? Because in certain cultures, you know, how women are treated, even, I mean, in all cultures, really, women are not treated near as well as they should be. And to have a strong and powerful woman like this 
uh, to have a legend or a story about her that's lasted for so long. If this is, you know, a true, true story and stuff like that, that's, you know, I, hey, I'm here for it. I'm here for it because, yeah, like I said, especially in cultures over in the Middle East, it's not a stretch to say that women are not highly favored. What I'm really interested to see more so than anything is is what they're going up against in terms of like the censorship of history and information and stuff like that. And what she was speaking was real deal, you know what I'm saying? Like the evil evil doers are basically people trying to extinguish the light of truth. And extinguishing truth can be in many ways. And most of the time it's just replacing it with your own version. Because as we know, the, the ones, the victors are the ones who write history. So I think it's pretty cool that we're finally getting a story about the daughter of Muhammad. I mean, when have we, I, I've never seen that story on the big screen, so I'm interested to see where that goes. Um, yeah, like I said, decent trailer. Props to the man of goodwill, I appreciate you. That was a, a good recommendation. And you know, hopefully the movie lives up because you know, not a whole lot of movies that are diving into religious uh topics and stuff like that and that's the main focus of the whole movie i can't sit here and act like all of them are great okay because a lot of them are not but if you if you choose the right stories i mean we can we can get some good stuff there so that's gonna do it for me i will catch you guys on the next trailer reaction or whatever else you bring to me i'm a man of the people i'm here for it so i'll catch y'all on the next one it's t-rav i'm out